Jane, yeah, you know, Luna Rosa is really in the heart of downtown Greenville, right? Really not far from City Hall, but like so many other businesses across the country, the owners here worry that COVID-19 is taking away their pride and joy. The concept here was really to open up a place that we would treat you like a home. And for 13 years, downtown Greenville has been home to Luna Rosa. In early 2020, the family-owned restaurant added enhancements like this outdoor patio. We were looking for, okay, this is the year that we're going to make and break it. And COVID hit. Sales have been down by about 70%. Owner Richard Schweitzer said he'd used up PPE loans and other federal loans, but with less profit and rising rent, the family now worried about staying afloat. We could have disappeared and been like, well, we're the afterthought now, and one of the last mom and pop places standing is done, or we figured it was worth putting ourselves out there to you know, the good and the bad that could come from doing this. Wednesday night, turning to GoFundMe for rent. To me, it's, it's I don't know, I, I felt like I was begging. It's just not our, not our MO, but to, in order to stay open, it, it almost became a necessity. Less than 24 hours later, more than $11,000 raised, half of the $22,000 goal. Last night, my daughter came into the bedroom and said, Oh my God, Dad, the first first donation was a thousand dollars. I said, what? I mean, I sat there like, teary-eyed, like, thousand dollars, that's a lot of money. Some regular customers back the next day. They're a family and they work hard, they're in this together. You become part of their family. Their patrons are part of their family. The support here has been beyond the wildest dreams, quite frankly. Some of you might know there is another Luna Rosa in Malden that opened January 1st. That is actually a separate entity from this one. It is owned by the owner's daughter and son-in-law. For now, in Greenville, Taggart Houck, WIFF News 4.